right, so we have Pikmin Four demo. Pikmin Four. So let's see what this is about. The graphics. Yeah, I like the graphics. Back real life. Press any button. Rescue shipwreck castaways on an uncharted planet with the help of Pikmin in this epic adventure. If you complete this demo, you can receive a special rewards in the Smart Z device app. Pikmin Bloom. Oh, play, play Pikmin Bloom one through two, one, two, two, two players or one? Oh, there's two players. Is there two players? All right, then give me game. All right, we have Plumber You support player one by using the Pebbles picture. Simple targeting. That is targeting. garbage, bro. That is garbage. What you mean? I thought it was like two dudes going pink <laughs> You can do it. Wow, one button game. One button game. Let's go! This is garbage. It ain't even like Kirby in the Forgotten Land where you get Waddle D. Ah, uh, you wanted Waddle D. You wanted Waddle D. He wanted one of them Pikmins to, uh, he wanted to control one of them Pikmins. It's Kirby, but it's still Waddle D. They don't even give you that. You just get to press the A button. All right, here we go. Hey, I'm a squad. Captain. I am Captain oh, yeah. Alamo. Captain Alamo. Wind, wind, wind. Get I command a spaceship wind. called the SS Dolphin. Hey. This is the story of how I crashed onto an unknown planet and how I was ultimately rescued. Oh, no, you spoiling the game. I gotta get out. I gotta what get you out. mean? That's Pikmin 1 spoilers. He could have died in Pikmin 1. Where else, my kid? After the crash, I woke up to find my ship was in pieces scattered everywhere. I had no way of returning home to my beloved family. Brooklyn. I thought Where I was doomed. Beat me. Pukna to pick me. Until I encounter a strange species. The Pikmin had an innate desire or will to tr carry objects. With their help, I was able to find and transport my missing ship parts. Time passed and I met yet another mysterious creature. It appeared to be malnourished. So I tossed over a treat. Scooby Snack. <laughs> After that, we quickly burned it. She is a steadfast partner in the quest to find the missing pieces of my spaceship. A quest that was nearing its end. We arrived at the last area we had left to explore. What is this place? That's your room. Something about this area is different from the others we've explored so far. Wait, where are you running off to? Thank <laughs> you. 
That can't be a good sign. The pigmen don't usually scare you off like that. I suppose I'll have to call them back while I search for the missing ship parts. <laughs> Press P2. <laughs> Look around. Hmm. I saw some of the pigment head this way. They could be hiding behind those things. Let's break them and see. When we jump, I'll start charging up my puff strength. I just need to press X and hold down. Then take aim. When she's at full strength, I'll let go and let her rush. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Pikmin. Aha, I knew it. Now I use B and down to call them back to me with my whistle. Just wish I knew why the pigment ran away and hid in the first place. Hmm, I better make a note of this in my voyage log. You never know when this kind of information will prove useful. Now, how to praise it. When I arrived at this area, the Pikmin started acting quite strange. They flew out of the onion and immediately hid. I can't find my spaceship parts without them. I suppose I'll just keep looking for them and can call them back using my whistle. I need to find my missing ship parts, but it will be much easier if I have more Pikmin to help me. At least I have a few more Pikmin now. Oops. Where else? Don't look before you leap. What is that? That's you. Oh, I thought to say, I'm like, what is that? We should search the area below. Is there some up there? I hear something. I'll use R to take peek. I use R to take a peek. A lot of them over here. They couldn't jump on the last game, too. Just stuck to the side of the dog. Oh, the They're hiding here too. 
You can't hide from me. Aha, I found you. You sound like a uh, dark faded only. I hear verses, voices I can check. Come on. Let's rush with it. Okay, there has to be a ship part around here somewhere. This is the perfect situation to rely upon my pup's powerful nose. Track down one of those ship part ship parts girl. We need to stay on the secret. Oh, I said the secret. We need to stay on that scent. No. Oops. Is that rush? A creature. I don't see any ship parts. Could that thing have swallowed one whole? Those spiky things are going to make this tough. I have to find an opening. Maybe I should use. Exit down to build up energy so we can rush the creature when the time is right. Oh my goodness. Got It's the intercellar radio. We relocated it at last. With this back in my possession, I can finally call for help. All right. <laughs> that porcupine, whatever it was, it was it was kind of tough a little bit. I did I just make it harder than it should have been. I have recovered the intercellular radio. So I immediately sent an SOS signal and attached the latest version of my voyage log. Days and weeks passed, but one month later, my signal reached the rescue corps. He took off toward this remote planet with noble plans to bring me home safe. Unfortunately, fate had other... I can't even see. The rescue officer sent to rescue me crash landed during their arrival. Double shipwreck. Double shipwrecks are rare and extremely. At this point, you might think that our hope was lost. But there was one last rescue officer left at Rescue Corps headquarters. A, a rookie, you. 
That's right. You are my last hope. Following emergency protocol, all officers were directed to evacuate the spaceship immediately. Finding the dispersed rescue course is now your top priority. Who's that? to work with don't they <laughs> color outfit his feet up there let me put it yeah it worked Adventurer. Yeah, it sure is inexperienced. <laughs> you better hope you make it out alive. <laughs> or more. It's all a more. Search for the missing rescue officers. Ah, oh, he's a cutie. Oachi. <laughs> this young lawyer rescue pup is one of an elite breed of space dogs. That's long served the shepherd family. This is his first mission. Without the rescue pup. All right. You encountered the rescue course rescue pup, Ayachi. I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> the remaining six rescue officers are still out there somewhere. You found someone in need of rescuing. Okay, let's rescue him then. <laughs> okay, go up here. I was supposed to do that. Send A. 
Oh, he pulled in his back. All right. All the dirt has been removed. Is that you, Oachi? Thank you. Thank the stars. I wasn't sure that my SOS signal had reached headquarters. So you and Oachi found and rescued me together? That's actually quite surprising. I've never known Oachi to listen to anyone other than our captain. Oh, I should probably introduce myself. I'm Colin, communications operator for the Rescue Corps. Hey, Colin. That's the Rescue Corps command comes operator. He handles communication for his fellow officers. Plus, he's handy with a wrench. All right, we found Colin. You meet up with Colin, the Rescue Corps com. Commander oper operator. That's one down. Now, where could the other rescue officers be? Hello. My path got cut off by a small landslide when I my hunger became unbearable. I decided to nap and preserve my stamina. You're our last. You're our latest recruit, right? It's got its feet, isn't it? Well, hey. I couldn't be more grateful to you for rescuing me. As I mentioned before, I was the one who sent out the emergency signal. The rest of the rescue corps, well, it was a rough landing. We entered the planet's atmosphere and lost control of the ship. What happened? Oh? I have no idea. There were six officers on the ship, but we were separated when we ejected from this spacecraft. We came here to find Captain Alamore whose own ship had crashed, only to suffer the same fate. Y'all need some new ships. <laughs> it's almost embarrassing. Can you go? I've confirmed that our spaceship, the SS Shepard, landed somewhere over there. But I couldn't reach it on my own. Now that you're here, maybe we can find a way back to it. Hello? And if we're looking, we'll come across a few stranded rescue officers along the way. Oh, before I forget, take this. It's an official rescue course tablet. We use them to share information. Thank goodness I always carry an extra. Tap up on the left side there to open and review your missions. You can use this app anytime to confirm what takes task or top priority. I have some other handy apps to share, but it'll install, but I'll install them later when we have a moment to Hello? rest. For now, just remember that you can always tap up to view missions. But if you press instead the minus and select shortcut settings, you can assign different functions to each shortcut button. Now then, let's go find the SS Shepherd. <laughs> there she is, the SS Shepherd. I can see the ship, but I have no idea how we're going to reach it from here. No? You know, there's something familiar about this area. I remember something. It's just up ahead. Let's go. Hello. There's no getting up there. I already tried. <laughs> she? The planets on this planets on this planet are gigantic. I always make sure this area is safe with or 
turn a bit. Look, that's it. See that big hole in the ground over there? If only we could find a way there, then we can finally reunite with the SS Shepherd. I need all. Oh, excuse me. Oh, hey. This is a perfect job for a rescue pup. They are known for being excellent. Yes, hey. there is. I don't know. Good pup, Arachi. Picture. Almost there. Hey. Boom. You can see why Ross rescue pups are the rescue course pride and joy. Huh? This looks just like the other hole we saw. Well done, Arachi. All right. On the pole? I wonder if these two holes are somehow connected underground. It looks pretty deep. We're just going to have to dive right in. Let's do it. Boy. That's the spirit. Here we go. Though it does look pretty dark down there. Let's just do it. Come on. <laughs> He's stuck up there. Oh my, what a place to find the captain. That's terrible. Individual you see over there is the captain of our rescue course team. Look, sharp goddess feet. The captain comes from a long line. <laughs> This is no time for a history lesson. Hurry up and do something. Ooh, she's feisty. What she gonna do? You gonna get them uh, plum? Phew, now we can relax a bit. Captain, we took care of the creatures down here. Can you get down? Oh. I hope so. My arms are almost numb. I've been hanging on so long. Okay, I can do this. What's your status, Colin? Are you okay? No, no. Shouldn't I be asking you that? I'm just relieved to see you're all right. Oh, you? I haven't seen you since rookie training camp. I'm Captain Shepard of the Rescue Corps. If you don't remember, did you order Oachi to get rid of those creatures all by yourself, Goddess B? Huh? Oachi's not supposed to obey anyone but me. Guess that rookie training paid off after all, didn't it? You know, the first time I saw you in training, I had a feeling you making top-notch dog trainer. 99 Gen Rescue Officer. She was saved by a rescue pup as a child, sparkling a lifelong love for her favorite colleagues. <laughs> B 
we found Captain Shepard with the captain here. It feels like there may be some hope for us after all. Sorry to interrupt, Captain, but uh, what were you doing down here anyway? While exploring the surface, I discovered a suspicious hole. I leaned over to take a look inside and fell right in. I wandered around this cave trying to find an exit when I came upon those icky, slimy creatures. Hang on. Did you fall down a hole located near the SS Shepherd? We entered this cave in an attempt to reach that very opening. Well then, what are we waiting around here for? Let's get back to the SS Shepherd. Copy that. Is something wrong? You didn't say anything, goddess fee. Copy that. It's the rescue course way of saying understood. Let's try saying it together, okay? Copy that. Very good. Excellent reply. That said, you need to review the rescue course rescue journal for your upcoming missions. It's essential to our work. This is where you will find advice left by Captain both past and present. I have no doubt the knowledge and wisdom they share here will guide you well. Irma Shepherd, Captain in command. You'll be able to access them via your tablet as the need arises. So put them to good use while out in the field. So Archie and you have bonded. I officially approve of your partnership. I'll be observing you both to see what skills you have as a rescue pup trainer. Quite the contrary. What would you do, Goddess Fee? Even Oachi can't chew his way through this one. That was quite a rush. I remember this area. There, that's where I fell in. My word, to think you survived a fall from that height. But more importantly, how are we supposed to climb up there? Hey, there's something under the light. <laughs> Reminds you of uh, Zelda. The <laughs> gush of wind. Excuse me, Goddess Feet. I suggest you exercise a bit more caution when encountering something unfamiliar. Maybe don't just touch it. I completely agree. Though in this case, your impulsive behavior did get us out of the cave. get a flag from <laughs> all right captain the rescue course flag has been officially planted now for the status report on all cave related activities we located and rescued one castaway and no other individuals were found during our search noted then let's consider the investigation of this cave complete i hope this experience will help you prepare for the challenges inherent to our work there are lives depending on okay? us. But you both did great good work today. Well done, Goddess Fee and Nuachi. I guess we're just going to skip right over the fact that we had to rescue the captain herself. Colin, you look different since the last time I saw you. Did you do something new with your hair? Can you go? I don't think so. I've been a bit busy trying to, you know, stay alive. Pardon? 
Of course. Good for you. You did it. Well, there she is. The SS Shepherd. Smoke pouring out of the SS Shepherd. I'll investigate right away. Famous last words. Okay. Status report. Upon investigating the interior of the ship, I discovered the engine had been had overheated yeah. and that the spaceship was seconds away from total destruction. Oh no, will it be okay? You. It will. I initiated an emergency shutdown and everything's stable. Thankfully, the engine can be repaired. However, the ship's energy stores are now completely empty. <laughs> so we have no way of getting off this planet, let alone searching for Captain Alomar. <laughs> Not necessarily. I think I saw something in Captain Alomar's voyage log. That may prove useful. Here it is. Take a look at this. After thorough investigation into the shiny objects found on this planet, I have deduced that they must contain sparkling. I feel giddy to have found real life treasure, but my focus must remain on my main objective. Finding the missing parts of the SS Dolphin, Alamo. In layman's terms, we should be able to extract sparkling from sparkling objects that we find on this planet and convert it into energy. If they can be used to restore and restore the SS Shepherd, those objects are truly are nothing short of real life treasures. I'm skeptical, <laughs> but at this point, we have nothing to lose. This may be our only chance. So from this point on, we have a new mission. Find and collect all the sparkly objects we can. Copy that. Apparently, sparkly objects can be used as an energy source. Locate as many as you can so you can restart the SS Shepherd. Once we collect this treasure, we'll need a way to transport it. Hello? For that, we can use the SS Beagle. Kaukji. You just need a good place for it to land. Kaukji. Huh? What's that over there? It's so shiny. Maybe it's some sort of landmark, but I'm not completely sure. It looks like the perfect spot for a base of operations called a ship over. It says speak of repositioning successful. Good, our preparations are complete. Let's find that re treasure. See anything sparkly around here? Oh. Is this what I think it is? <laughs> this has to be a treasure. Just look at the way it sparkles. Oh. Let's check the tablet to see if it's emitting a high energy reading. All right, rookie, press plus to open the read radar map. Yeah, Presses of sparkling confirmed that in the center represents the treasure. 
From now on, you can consult your radar map to check if there's on any treasure in your area. Excellent work. I'm going to take this auspicious store as a good sign. But um, how are we going to move it? Evacuation complete. Hi. Hello, hello. That's a fork. <laughs> the treasure is large. How can we physically collect something this big? The ship uses a special type of light ray that mini miniaturizes objects during collection, so it shouldn't be a problem. I'll examine it with the senses on the SS Beagle right away. Let's hope it contains the type of energy we need. Yes, energy detected. If we could collect 250 more units of sparkling, we may be able to restore the SS Shepherd. But the SS Shepherd is supposed to run on high octane energy. Will this work? I believe we can get it to run on sparkly I'm alone, though it may be a bumper ride. But before that can happen, we are going to need a lot more. Then we need to search the area for more treasure. They won't let you save. Hmm? Then I have to start over. What's this? Is this a treasure? Good job, Oachi. It's a treasure. Kaupuchi. What could it be? It looks kind of like a plant. Could this be the thing Captain Olimar wrote about in his voyage log? Kaupuchi. He called it an onion. Kaupuchi. If this isn't an onion, then what is that sprout? <laughs> Red pigment. Oh my, I, this, I think this could be a pink fin. According to Captain Alamore's voyage log, they're friendly and helpful creatures. Oh. Well then, maybe they could help us while we explore and look for treasure. Look at that. Oachi's already bunted with the Pikmin. You should introduce yourself as Goddess Feet. Uh, um, Captain, how long do you intend to hide back there? Alright, I think I will end it here, you guys. Alright. <laughs> so, yeah, I think I am liking the game. And, yeah, we'll pick up on the rest of it. 
tomorrow and yeah be, make sure you like the video if you haven't subscribed yet if you don't mind hitting that subscribe button i appreciate it and yeah you all take care and thank you for watching